Hi, it's Samantha from Samantha by Design. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new here. Today's time-lapse painting is a pet portrait commission of two gorgeous dogs, Rowdy and Lexi. I absolutely loved creating this piece, and I hope you enjoy the video. I'm working on a 12 by 16 inch gallery wrapped canvas that I primed with gesso and a wash of burnt sienna. I transferred my drawing using some Sorrel transfer paper in yellow. I was given complete creative freedom with this piece so I thought a fun funky background in a bluish green range would really make these dogs pop and come to life. I made sure to keep the middle of the canvas lighter in order to draw your eyes towards the dog's faces. To achieve the look I was going for, I used some stencils, some sponges and brushes, a toothbrush, don't ever use it for your teeth again, and some napkins. Since acrylic paint dries fast, I mixed all the colors that I needed before I started painting the first dog, as opposed to mixing as I go. And of course, if you've been watching me for a while, you probably know by now that I like to start with the eyes, the nose, and the mouth. These are the sections that I like to take my time on because these are the features that differentiate these dogs from other dogs. Once those parts were finished, I moved on to the rest of the face, making sure that I'm painting in the direction of the fur, and also making sure that my lights and darks are in the right spot. First layer of the face is done, so it's time to paint the body with the same exact techniques. I'm working from dark to light, section by section, I'm making sure that my colors are in the right spot and that the fur is going in the right direction. That first layer is finished, so it's time to add another. This layer is to assure that I have good coverage and good texture. 
I'm going to be refining the shadows and the highlights and I'll keep playing around with this until I'm happy with the way it looks. Now it's time to add a second layer to the face as well and I'm making sure to pick up all the slight color variations that Rowdy has. One dog down, one to go. I'm mixing a separate color palette for Lexi and I'll be repeating the exact same process until I'm happy with the way she looks. You got me so
layer one is all done, so let's start layer two. what the finished painting looks like. If you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave me a like and subscribe to the channel. It's free and it makes me happy and it actually does really help me out. You can find the links to my social media accounts in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you a lot and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!